A $4 million smart fish farm expected to produce about 350 tons of fish annually was officially launched today, opening the door to better food security for Singapore. The floating farm uses artificial intelligence and video analytics to monitor fish and detect early signs of disease. Vanessa Lim with more. When fully operational in 2021, this 3,000 square meter farm off Pasiris will be able to produce 350 tons of fish a year. That's about 6% of the total amount of fish produced in Singapore in 2018. It's using a closed containment system to isolate the fish from the ocean, to guard against threats like algae blooms and oil spills. And sensors monitor water quality as well as oxygen and acidity levels to make operations more efficient. This is the heart of the farm's operations. Now this system over here uses artificial intelligence to monitor fish movements and also it's programmed to detect early signs of a disease like white spots on a fish. Now it also looks at the behavior of fish during feeding to determine when to stop and this prevents overfeeding. Now all this helps to boost productivity and also reduce fish mortality rates. The company behind the farm says automating processes and going high-tech could also attract more to join the trade. We want uh, to offer jobs more towards process design, towards engineering, uh, towards artificial intelligence. These are things that young people want to work with. And uh, this is important if the fish farming um, community wants to move forward and engage the next generation. And this is key, with the country looking to ramp up local production to meet 30% of its nutritional needs by 2030. Our food production methods and technology must therefore adapt and improve. In the face of challenges posed by climate change, our food production must not only be high yielding, it must also be climate resilient and resource efficient. Food security will be a focus at the upcoming Committee of Supply debate.